Beth, the assembly voted seven to five in a measure that implements an annual fee to operate Airbnbs and other short-term rental operations in Anchorage. It will also eventually require those who operate those businesses to have a license. The assembly members who argued against requiring operators of short-term rentals to be licensed in Anchorage say that landlords already deal with enough regulation and rules that tie their hands when dealing with unruly tenants. They also pointed to people who go into short-term rentals out of necessity. On the other hand, those who support the measure say it protects the consumer and offers a way to keep track of bad actors. That it is our role to step in to re regulate. I think, uh, like hotels and long-term rentals, I think it's our role to to establish regulation and limits, um, and to and, and to play that part as it relates to, to short-term rentals. You don't need to create another bureaucracy to figure out why being a landlord sucks and why you would want to go to Airbnb. The information is out there. Talk to the real estate industry. Talk to the owners. We do not need more government. We don't need more regulation. The city has a minimum of 180 days to implement the program. It needs to start requiring people to be licensed to have short-term rentals in Anchorage. The fee is going to be $200 per year, and that will cover the fees to operate the licensing system. Separately, the mayor's ordinance that would ban people from pitching a tent 10 blocks from a licensed homeless shelter and an ordinance that would make some right turns on red lights downtown illegal are both postponed.